So, we, like we saw in the previous exercise, to to call a function, you would do something like, uh, let's say that I'm calling the function random, right? So I have it here, so I will say then print random dot random, and I'm calling it here because I'm calling, for example, print is a function, so I'm calling it by putting the parentheses. So you call a function by putting parentheses like this, and you define it by saying the EF. I cannot define print because it's already defined in Python by nature, so you should not do it. You should not do it. But for this exercise, instead of create a, calling a function, we want to create our own function. So we are going to use the DEF. So it's saying the function add numbers is supposed to return the sum of two given numbers. So a function returns at the end always. It should be returning at the end like this, return. And then you can return four if you like, for example. So all functions should return. There are ways, there are moments in which, ones, in which you, you don't want to return. But that's not very common. So you and if you assume that every function returns, it's not gonna go bad. It's gonna go good. You can return known if you like, or you can return an empty string or something that you know it's not useful or you don't care about it. But you should always return. It's a good practice. So right now it's telling that we should return the sum of two given numbers. So at numbers, it has two inputs here, two given numbers. That someone is. It's when, when someone calls this function, instead of defining it, when they call it, they will have to pass this to because it's being said in the definition. Like it accepts or it has to accept two different uh, variables. So, for example, in the line number A here is being called, you see, add numbers, and it's passing A and B. So, 3 and 4 will become A and B. So, I can return A plus B. So, that will return the sum of the two given numbers. Complete the needed code inside the function to make it uh, behave as expected. The exercise should print the number 7 in the console. Yeah, because it's being hard coded here to 3 and 4. Let me see. Yeah. Here is the number 7. So I think we're done. Let me see. Yeah, success.